Yep. Outside the NBA. Yep, on Facebook. Thanks Facebook. for being with us, y'all. Michael Lealy is our special guest. Special oh. guest. I think I'll get some hair. I think I'll cut it off. <laughs> and they still look good. <laughs> Pretty man. What you got on, Stockett? Who's the best? Stockett. <laughs> you, know, you know they got on Spanx. Have you ever made a movie, and while you was doing it, you said to yourself, this going to suck? Platinum? <laughs> Rubies go platinum? <laughs> they go platinum. I enjoy being in the house with friends. You don't have 30 friends. I have 30 friends on Super Bowl Sunday. Okay. You're a long time yeah. friend of the show. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Chuck. What? Same thing you said about Rick Fox. He's a pretty man. <laughs> <laughs> You know what else you say about Rick Fox? Hey, the only hey, guy, hey, the only hey, guy who hey, looks hey, worse in makeup. Let me tell you something. You know, he got the Rick Fox disease too. Like they just like, I think I'll get some hair. I think I cut it off, and they still look good. <laughs> Pretty man. What are you working on these days, man? Oh man, I'm I'm uh, shooting right across the street from y'all. I'm over here working on being Mary Jane right now with Gabrielle Union, and uh, one of Chuck's yeah. great friends. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. I like Gabby. Yeah. She hates me. Yeah, yeah. I, I would still, she thinks Dwayne should make the All Star team this year. <laughs> <laughs> you're not. You're not doing much for the relationship. You're not doing that for the way. Yeah. 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 Oh man. Yeah. You, you can bring her over next week. Yeah. And we can be, do it on the be more too. fun. Wouldn't and, it? And, we, and we'll get, and we'll get oh, everything. Be, and we'll exactly. get everything squared. I like Gabby a lot. Yeah. Okay. Hey, so let me ask you a question. What's yeah. more fun for you, doing a series or doing a movie? Um. Probably, probably a series because you get to, uh, you know, paint on that canvas for a longer amount of time, mm -hmm. yeah. and your um, flexibility with a series is a little bit more than it is with a movie. A movie, you know, the beginning, middle, and end, and with a series, it can obviously change from season to season. And what about being able to kind of get a, a camaraderie with the cast because a season obviously lasts longer than a movie with most times, correct? Yeah, ironically, um, in, a, in, a, in a series, uh, you can fall out with the cast just as quickly as you can fall <laughs> in love with them. So with a movie, what? you're more than likely to, to maintain your friendships with the cast because it's only, you know, two to five months, right. you know, and then it's over. But with a series, you can shoot anywhere from four to eight months and, whew, Sometimes, you know, you just, you be tired yeah, sometimes, of people Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, like, I, I know that know feeling. Really? You be tired of I know that feeling, like being that. on a series. I know <laughs> that feeling. Falling in and out. Falling yeah, out I'm of love. I'm not going yeah. to ask you an acting question because we're both experienced actors over that here. That we are. You that got about are. 20 years. Yeah, actor to actor, actor here. Yeah. Where are you from? Favorite football team and your Super Bowl predictions. Okay. I'm from Maryland, and I grew up a Skins fan. So, uh, but my prediction, I'm predicting, I really am going to predict an upset. There you go. I think, I think defense always wins the Super Bowl. I really do. So I think, I don't think it's going, what'd you say, 31? 31-17 Eagles. I don't see that. But I think, <laughs> I say like 27-24. Eagles. Philly. Eagles. Okay. Philly. Shaq, who you got? I got to go with Mr. Perfect, Tom Brady. Reminds me of uh, Phil Jackson and, you know, Greg Popovich. When they make it that far, they always win the system. And even though Tom is 40-something, is, is He's playing 40. fabulous. And, you know, yeah. his team, they always play the right way. And what I like about them is they, they don't do a lot of celebrating until, the, until it's over. Until it's mm -hmm. over. Also, you know, those are the type of teams that I, yeah. that I really like. You know, not the ones that celebrate after every big play, every touchdown. They just handle business. And then when it's over. I, I agree with Shaq on that. If you look at their interviews, it feels like it's game three of week three. <laughs> when you watch the interviews, yeah. and I'm like, do they not realize they're at the Super Bowl? Yeah. And that is, as I'm sure what you would say is like going back to back. And, and when I just remember the teams and when we went back to back, that second one, you're like, you're not excited to be in the city or in the opportunity. Mm -hmm. And I was like, oh, they have that. Right. Without question. That's not even in the, in the thought process. 27-17, Patriots. You, you, you know, Ernie, to, to pick it back on what Kenny was saying, I actually, I watch the Patriots and I watch University of Alabama. Mm. Like, they're so professional. No panic. They don't have no, no peaks panic. and valleys. Nope. Right. Like, when, when they got a big game, I noticed the other team is jumping up and down in the tunnel and they high-fiving each other and they're going crazy. And Alabama players are like, we know what we got to do to win. It's yeah. pretty amazing to watch. Players only, guys, they all weighed in on who they think is going to win the Super Bowl. Here it is. Who do I think is going to win the Super Bowl? I would definitely
definitely have to say the New England Patriots. I'm going to go with the Eagles. I don't even believe I'm saying that. But I'm going to go with the Eagles win the Super Bowl. Even though I'm a coach your kid, Philadelphia Eagles, can't bet against the GOAT. I'm going with New England. What, what kind of Bostonian would I be if I didn't pick the Patriots? I mean, come on now. I'm going with the Pats. I've uh, been a Patriots fan for a long time. It's very easy being a Patriots fan when you have Bill Belichick as the coach and Tom Brady as a QB. My Super Bowl prediction is Tom Brady again. Can I say Raiders? Patriots by 17, period. I believe in dominance. I'm going with Tom Brady and the Patriots. Raiders. In the NBA, we have a guy that runs a very great system. His name is, what's his name? Popovich. Yeah, Popovich. <laughs> so, <laughs> Bilicek runs the same system in football. Can never bet against a great Tom Brady. Patriots, by three touchdowns. I saw Baron Davis. Baron Davis went ahead and picked the Raiders. You want to go ahead and pick the Redskins in this one? No. <laughs> no. No, we haven't been there in 20 something years. We got we got a lot of work to do. Got a lot of work. Where's the best place to do. watch? Where's the best place to watch the Super Bowl? What's the Super Bowl Sunday like uh, for you, Kenny? Well, I've I've only I've gone twice in my whole life. Mm -hmm. And that was a unique experience. I think you do have to try to do that at least once or twice. I I went last year, so I will, if you could go to one, last year was the one to go to. But um I enjoy being in the house with friends. I, like, I don't like bars or lounges. I would like my house or someone else's house and multiple TVs just all around and everybody going room to room. And well, you have multiple time. TVs, you're watching the same thing. Because we have more than one person in the home, so we might have... Wander five, around 30, and watch, yeah. 30 people in the house. So you don't have 30 friends. Let's get that out the way. Okay. I have 30 friends on Super Bowl Sunday. I'll okay. Say. Michael, where will you watch again? <laughs> um, I'm probably going to... I think I'm going to be here. So... Uh, I think I'll either be in my hotel room or... Uh, oh, my goodness. What a loser. You know, can I come by your spot? I'll be in Vegas. You can come to Vegas ah. with me. I don't know. I got to work. Okay. Man, I'll get wait. you back on the red eye. Okay. All right. All right. <laughs> you will have some red eyes. <laughs> you definitely have some red eyes. Yeah. I, Chuck, I mean, can, Chuck, you always go to, uh, you always go to Vegas? I've always been to Vegas. I've been to Vegas 25 straight years. It's awesome to watch there. Uh, I'm in a room with about five to 7,000 people. Uh, we wow. all—it's crazy because everybody bet. Man. I mean, people go crazy on the national anthem. They bet on the time. People go crazy <laughs> over the coin. They bet on wait. Oh yeah, that's one of those prop they bets. They bet on the time. Yeah, of the on, on the national anthem. Over, I think it's two minutes over and under. And like one, Are you me? one section to go. Who's singing this shit? This shit? Uh, Pink, I think it is. Oh, it's over two minutes. But I'm saying, but so <laughs> or like one section over here goes crazy, and we're like, what happened over there? They bet on the national anthem. Then one section go crazy over here. They're like, they bet on the coin flip. Oh. And then one God. section to go crazy, like. They had over and under on sacks, and then people bet on the game. Oh. They got any food. Oh, they actually bet on the game, too? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, they got any food in the world you want and any alcoholic refreshments. Do you, have, do you guys make a conscious, <laughs> do you make a conscious effort to watch halftime? I do. Yes. I do. Oh, yeah. Oh, go, yeah. You got to watch halftime. Yeah, halftime. Watch that's, yeah. when it, that's when everybody gets together. Well, first of all, and, yeah. that's, and that's like, like, first of all, there's like a minute where you get to go to the bathroom before halftime starts because you can't leave during the game because I got to watch every commercial. And there's seven the best thing about the, 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 the best thing about the Super Bowl is the commercials. So you so they play the commercials in Vegas too? The oh, yeah. They got like 500 screens all around the place. It's crazy. Yeah. Okay. Obviously. Wow. What you got on? Stockets? Who's the best? Stockings. <laughs> no, you know they got on Spanx. They got on Spanx. Got Spanx. <laughs> I just check it. All right, guys. I'm what's, sorry. What's, the best, what's the best Super Bowl halftime? Beyonce in New Orleans was, was tight. Oh. When the light shut off, that was tight. I, I got to give it up to Prince in Miami. Oh, yeah. Yep. I that. Ooh. yeah. Best of national I anthem, no Prince. doubt, Whitney Houston. Yeah, that was Still. good. Still. Still. I got I to quote you. How about, the, how about the wardrobe malfunction? I was it at It would have been one. good. You were there? I was at that game. It was in Houston, and we didn't see, you know, live, you didn't see yeah, anything. Until the next day. Just, you heard all about yeah. it. Like, your phone was just buzzing after that. Well, Justin Timberlake, again, uh, at, at, at uh, this Super Bowl. He said he didn't know anything about the football. We'll do the halftime. And any time <laughs> we bring up Justin Timberlake's name, oh. we have to go back to All-Star Weekend of the NBA. What happened? In the celebrity game. Uh, oh, get that out of here. That was foul. And one. That's right. But look at this. Here's I was playing around. Look, I'm going to let him close it. I got it. Oh. I got and, it. and watch this. Oh! oh! Yeah, yeah. Why is the jersey so big? <laughs>
the cut to me, have muscles. <laughs> that, they, they, Why they, would they, they gave me like they, they, No, no, he used to have muscles back in the day. They just made the fake jersey. That was a replica. Of, <laughs> no, 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 no. That wasn't my actual No, you, do you, he used to have like a real body. <laughs> <laughs> All the time. Oh, I, I always ask my active, my active friends this. You have active friends? I do. You have, okay. Have you ever... You active friends? You've been in a bunch of active. movies. Oh, mm -hmm. actor friends. Have you ever made a movie and while you was doing it, you said to yourself, this is gonna suck. <laughs> that's a great question. That's a, that's a really good question. I'm trying to think if I have. Um, no, Chuck, no. he's a thespian. No, okay. No. Because like sometimes we see movies, I'm not talking about you yeah. particular movie. You see a movie, you're like, this is awful. And they, sometimes it's like great actors. Right. And when you watch the movie, you're like, because I've Some done- Some of that's in the editing though, as well, correct? Editing. Yeah. yeah, you ever surprised with what with the finished product? Yeah, sometimes that's the thing. Like no, and I've had to learn this because I used to be like you, I used to be really critical. And you know, when I saw a movie, I'd be like, oh, he sucked, the movie sucked, blah, blah, blah. The bottom line is nobody tries to make a bad movie. Mm -hmm. Um sometimes it, but it takes so many people, mm -hmm. and there's so many people behind the scenes at the studio and stuff that that get involved, and sometimes that's what tears the movie okay. apart. And it's not just the filmmaker, it's not just the actor. So it, 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 it takes a village to make a good movie and it takes a village to mess up a movie as well. Okay. Toughest role you've ever had. What's the biggest challenge? Probably uh, what, I, uh, what I did last time I was here, which was, um, and that's coming out later this year, and that's, that's the remake of Jacob's Ladder. Mm. Um, that, is, that is a disturbing film. <laughs> and uh, to go there was, was, was rough. Yeah. It was rough. So you play a good guy or a bad guy is better. Bad guy. Okay. All day. <laughs> All day. I'll take the bad guy. Oh man. Oh, you like hiding under beds. That's fun. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that is fun. You know, yeah, that, that might be one of the all-time favorite. Still in uh, people's watches. You no, know, that might be one of the all-time favorite uh, trailers. Really? That might be one of my. That, that trailer favorite. got that a trailer, lot of attention. That yeah, trailer was really good. It did. It did. That was a, that was a fun movie to do. Did you, a real fun did you ever see his uh, his blockbuster? Kazan. That was great acting right there. Great acting. Movies for kids. You should be ashamed of yourself for watching that movie. I, mean. I haven't seen it. <laughs> this is this is as much as I've seen of it. Great facial expression. Every great time deliverance. We, what was the one? Great that you deliverance. Did with Adam Sandler and uh, Grown Ups too. When he was a cop. Oh, that was Have you ever made a good movie? Was, yeah, all my movies go no, platinum. No, 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 no. All, my all movies his movies go platinum? Go platinum? <laughs> movies, movies go, go platinum? platinum. <laughs> they go platinum. At least Trust a million me. people see them. Trust me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he's saying. They go platinum. <laughs> <laughs> a million people see them. Uh, uh, Oh, Bieber, well, Bieber, Bieber crushed you? No, that ain't me. Oh. <laughs> Bieber crushed no, you? No, that ain't me. Okay, Biebs. No. <laughs> this, ain't, this ain't pop star cross kitty over day. Knock it off. <laughs> Michael Ely. Great to see you, man. Thank Thanks you, for man. doing it. Anytime, Thanks Justin. Rematch. Continue your success, my man. Thank you, buddy. Right, Appreciate brother. it, man. See you all time. Appreciate it. That's Thanks. What, that's what we call outside the NBA on Facebook.